I have 58 minutes to my phone. All my videos are all two-hour videos now. But I told you, a two-hour video for Ivan Romero is nothing. Because when I speak, time stops, obviously. Right? <laughs> Right? And yeah, man. That's what. Right? And I don't know, the 10 days are up. I booked my private flight to Los Angeles. I booked my private flight to Los Angeles, obviously. Right? I booked my... I booked my private flight to Los Angeles. As I am not flying commercial, I cannot stand commercial. One, now that I'm a billionaire, I am never flying commercial ever. I'm gonna, I'm gonna tell you, David, me and you never have to fly commercial ever again. We can fly privately. We don't. We know. We don't have to wait in line. We don't have to go through the security customs. Me and Vijay can just take the VIP and go fly privately on our plane, which is fucking cool, obviously. Yeah. So I'm gonna I'll charter my own plane. I'll book a private flight. To what? To uh, Los Angeles. And during that flight, I'm gonna be going, well, holy shit, it's so so cool being on this plane. Because I've never been on a plane before, obviously. I put services into wine, I have a glass of wine, I watch TV. You know, okay, we're off Los Angeles, I'm saying. And I'm like, oh my god, we're about to see my beautiful wife. And I'm gonna be nervous. Oh, what's it gonna be like seeing her, man? Because I've never been in a relationship before. Because even though VJ will be nervous, VJ knows what's like to be in relationships. Because VJ had boyfriends and the mess happened, obviously. If shit went down behind the scenes, VJ obviously went on dates with guys and that kind of stuff. See what I'm saying? But B, my point is, VJ had boyfriends. You had the mess. VJ had boyfriends. That's my point. Because VJ had boyfriends, VJ knows what it's like to be in a relationship. See what I'm saying here? Was I don't know what it's like to be in a relationship. Hence why, even though I had sex with a lot of women, I don't know what it's like to be in a normal relationship. I'll no longer be this square shy either because I had sex with so much women. But I'll know what it's like. But I'll know what's like to what. I'll know what's like to what. I'll know what's. Uh, I, 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 I won't be square or shy anymore because I know what's like. I had sex with so much women, but I don't know what's like to be in a relationship. Hence, why I'm going to be very shy when I see my beautiful wife. See what I'm saying? I'm going to be very, very nervous. You know what I'm saying? The moment, the moment the guys, the moment the pod says, "Okay, we're out and we're arriving to Los Angeles," I have in 30 minutes. My heart's going to start beating. I'm like, "Holy shit! I'm about to see my wife." You know what I'm saying? This is it. I'm going to be in a relationship. I'm going to officially be in a relationship. I finally know what's like to be in a relationship. So after me suffering death, because you guys are fucking crazy people, the whole mess, obviously, the door is being locked on me. Obviously, the door is being locked on me. I finally know what's like to be in a normal relationship because you guys are crazy, psychotic people. I finally know what's like to be in a normal relationship and I see my wife after 30 years and you think I'm going to let you do it like that. I am piecing the fuck out and I'm never making evil you ever again. I'm not going to do it like that, man. I see my wife after 30 years, you think I'm going to take my time and make real street. No, I'm not going to do it like that. You made me pay my wife and you're also going to pay my life by advance. That's how it works, obviously. And you guys see the future, you know I'm not going to do it like that. I am peace, take my wife and I'm peacing the fuck out with her after this. Right? Right? I don't know, I arrived, I arrived to Los Angeles in the airport, obviously. So high chance I'll be meeting VJ behind the airport because if, if I fly privately, I don't have to go through security. Because I, I'm, I'm, I'm flying privately. Because I'm flying privately, I don't have to go through security in the airport. I can just go from the back. I believe if you fly privately, you don't, you don't have to go through airport security. I can, you can just fly privately, obviously. So you, you, you just have to show them your passport and that's it. You show them your passport, I don't have to go through airport security, I believe. It's a good chance I'll see her either in the airport or outside the airport. You know what I'm saying? The moment I arrive, you should be like, oh my god, Ivan's arrived. She has her luggage all ready to go, and I'm saying, she's looking nice. She's wearing her nice clothes. Obviously, I don't know. Like I get, I get all the, I get out the, I get out the plane. I go in the airport or behind the airport, whatever it is. We'll see what happens. Obviously, and I, 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 I I'm like, I'm walking. And I, I core my eye. I see VJ within the crowd. Obviously, and she's staring at me. She's all excited to see me. I'm saying, just like that scene in, in Friends when Rachel was waiting for Ross. Remember that scene when Rachel was waiting for Ross. She wanted to tell him something, and Ross shows up with with this other girl in like season two, the beginning of season two, I believe. You see Rachel all anxious to see him. Well, think of something like that for me and Vijay. Think something like that for me and Vijay. You're gonna see me and Vijay, you know what I'm saying? Me and Vijay, you're gonna see Vijay all anxious to see me. 
You get so anxious in this. And the moment she sees me, she's going to cry. I am definitely going to tear up when I see her because I know what hell I want here just to see my wife, man. I haven't seen my wife since birth for 30 years because you guys are crazy psychopaths. Oh, yeah, I have more crazy psychopaths. Yes, you're crazy psychopaths. I haven't seen her since birth, obviously, 30 years. Think about that for a second. I have not seen VJ for 30 years, obviously. I finally see her face after 30 years. She sees my face after 30 years. See what I'm saying? She sees my face after 30 years. And as soon as she sees me, she gives me this big ass hug, man. This big tight hug. Like a when I mean big tight hug, I mean she gives me this huge, like tight hug. You know, it's like Vijay loves me so much, obviously. And I love her too, obviously. We love each other dearly, obviously. I give her this big ass hug, I'm saying, and I'm like, oh my god. First thing I'm gonna be shocked when I see her, I'm like, oh my god, I can't believe this hot ass chick is my wife, man. I see her waiting for you, oh my god, this chick is fucking hot. You know what I'm saying? And Vijay's like, I can't believe this handsome man's my husband. You didn't see something looks like crazy. Obviously. And I give her this hug. It's a good chance. I'm not comfortable kissing her in public. That's the thing though, man. I'll eventually get comfortable. Well, when we're at the club, I'll make out with her. But if I'm if but but there's a good chance she will she'll want to kiss me too, though. She'll give me a hug and she'll even kiss me too. Because Vijay's fucking crazy, obviously. You know what I'm saying? We exit the airport and everyone pulls out their phone and they take pictures, obviously. And guarantee those pictures will be trying like, oh my god, this is I and Vijay meeting each other for the first time. Yeah. My prediction is the first picture you're going to see of me and Vijay together is us at the airport. That's going to be the first picture you're going to see of me and Vijay together. And then me and Vijay will leave the airport, obviously. Vijay, the first thing Vijay will ask me, Ivan, how much money did you get paid? I don't know, Vijay. I got paid $6.8 billion. Vijay's like, holy shit, Ivan, that's a lot of money. By the way, how much money do you have in your bank? I don't know, Ivan. I have $40,000 in my bank. I'm saying Vijay's like poor. <laughs> she has like no money. So I guarantee you, why pay the fee? Vijay's going to blow all her money. She's probably going to go on vacation. And just constantly, She's going to go on stay at suites and blow all her money. Obviously. Because I guarantee you, Vijay will have like no money when I meet her, man. She'll either have like no money or she'll have like maybe a hundred grand, two hundred grand or bank, which can easily get drained, obviously, right? That's why what? You guys gonna be like, I don't even know how much money did you get paid. I don't know, Vijay. I got paid six point six point six point eight billion dollars. Vijay's like, holy shit, I got a lot of money. I'm like, yes, we it's a lot of money, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? And then and then and, and what? We go to the hotel. Okay, I by the way, are you gonna share that? I'm like, yeah, I'm gonna share you. Are you going to share that? I'm like, yeah, I'm going to share it with you. And once you go to Vancouver, we'll register for our Scotiabank card and Visa. The reason why Vijay is going to ask me, are you going to share it? Because Vijay's a Hollywood chick. She's greedy. And she wants a piece of the pie, obviously. And she deserves it because she's my wife. She's my nature. And she's my queen. And that's why she's the only one who's worth my royalties, obviously. And you're welcome, sweetie. Great. And then once we go, I'm like, hey, Vijay, do you know any top-notch hotels? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know a few top-notch hotels. And me and Vijay, we book, we book what we book. I book a nice suite. Me and Vijay stay at a nice like six, seven thousand dollar nice suite with a nice jacuzzi. I'm gonna say, hey, I want, I want one of your suites with a jacuzzi because I want to go in a jacuzzi with Vijay. Obviously, I want services for wine, all that stuff. Right? I booked, a, I book a nice like six thousand, seven thousand dollars nice suite in Los Angeles, and we stay at that suite for two days. And guarantee when I go to that room. Me and Vijay are going to hook up. We're going to have mad crazy sex. My looks been crazy. It's because your tension was building up. The moment she hugs me, I'll be turned on. I want to, and because I, because I was a man who I'm no longer just shy square Ivan. I'll now want to have sex with her badly. And she'll want to have sex with me because she's a whore, obviously. No, I'm joking. We both want to have sex with each other badly. That's why when we go to that room, guaranteed, guaranteed we're going to hook up right away. She's going to kiss me. And we're going to start making out hardcore. And guaranteed we're going to hook up right away. We're going to have mad crazy sex, man. Crazy, crazy sex. So he looks me crazy. You know what I'm saying? But the one thing that will always get to me is knowing that many men touched her, man. And she made me pay a price. So when she's turned on and she's naked, it's, it's a shitty feeling knowing that she took off her clothes. She took off her clothes and another man was entering with her too. It's a shitty feeling. You made me pay a price. And you're also going to pay a price. It's a shitty feeling knowing that her husband was entering with another woman. She took off her clothes. It's a shitty feeling. We both had that shitty feeling. And you made it. You made us pay to be together. That's when we're king, queen, you're left behind. You're not safe. I keep saying that. I don't know. After we hook up, we're relaxed, we're calm. We, hey, hey, let's go in the jacuzzi. You know what I'm saying? Me and VJ, we go, we take a shower, we go in the jacuzzi. We, we take a shower first. That's gross. We take a shower first, and then we go in the jacuzzi. Hey, VJ, let's take a shower. I don't know. We hook up in the shower again. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. That's how crazy me and VJ are going to be together. You know what I'm saying? And then we what? And then we go in the jacuzzi, and me and VJ, we talk about Skype Source. I tell, I don't know, VJ's. 
I'm a, I, I sit across from VJ. We have a wine. We talk, I talk about Sky. So VJ, yeah, I have nice. Saw our YouTube videos. I'm like, yes. And the reason why VJ is now acknowledging that she watches all my videos is because now she can see me. And once she says that, it will finally confirm for me. Oh my God, the whole world's watching my videos, but they keep me behind the scenes. Hence why I'm not going to do like that. I'm piecing the fuck on my to this. All I need is for VJ to say that that one word. Yeah, I have nice. Saw our YouTube videos. Is now she can see me. It's finally gonna dawn on me. Oh my god, the whole world's watching my videos, but it keep me on scenes. That's why I'm not gonna do that. I'm peace out my wife for this. You can't have your full cake, it's not how it works. As I'm not gonna let you do it like that. Yeah, there you go. You know what I'm saying? You know, I mean I saw your YouTube videos, I'm saying I know you want to start your big sky source entertainment company. I'm like, yes, sweetie. I want to start my big sky source entertainment company, obviously. VJ, are you with me on this? Ivan, I am with you on this. No, VJ, I can't do this without you. I need you working your ass off. We cannot be slacking off with each other possible things. No, Ivan, I promise I'll work my ass off. I am with you on this. And VJ will work her ass off because I saved her ass. She is free because of me. Obviously, she's a multi billionaire because of me and she's queen because of me. That's why VJ will work her ass off, obviously. And you're going to see VJ working hard in the office. But I told you, me and VJ will barely be making any business calls. As the 17, we'll be doing all the dirty work. As me and VJ are only going to make calls for some of the main stuff. Sign a contract and, and, and just do the concerts. That's it, man. But the seven team are doing all the dirty work. Because if, if you and your wife are the boss, you put your team to work. That's how it works. I don't pay you one million, two million for nothing. I'm going to put you to fucking work, man. You're going to be hard at work every day, man. You know what I'm saying? You know, so I don't know. After we, after we chill in jacuzzi, we give a toast. Hey, we just give a toast to the bright future ahead. We give an amazing toast. And then me and Vijay, we go hang out at the restaurant. The bar restaurant. We have we have we have lunch. we have dinner obviously. I know I get I get a nice pizza, a nice burger and fries. I'm a fan of burger and fries. Whenever I go to a bar restaurant, I either get a pizza or I just get burger and fries. That's what I'm a fan of, obviously. Vija orders her food, we have a beer, we have a nice talk. And while we do that, people are gonna in the Los Angeles are gonna be staring, taking out their phones, taking videos and pictures, trying to line the whole world watching as me and Vija will begin to fill on top of the world. It's like an adrenaline rush. And after me and Vijay eat, we can go back to the condo, chill for a bit. And around like 10, 30, 11, we can go, the, we can go clubbing for a good three hours. Three, four. Because most clubs close around one or two. Hey, Vijay, you want to go clubbing? Me and Vijay, hey, yeah, I, mean, I know a few clubs. We go to a top-notch club in Los Angeles and me and Vijay go clubbing. And we go out, people, we, I don't, we get out of the cab. People are going to take pictures and videos. That's going to be trying online. The whole world watching me and Vijay feeling on top of the world. That's why Vijay's family would get to feel like shit. VJ's family begin to feel like shit, obviously, because they're not left behind, obviously. And my family begin to feel like shit because, 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 because. Now they see the trending pictures of I and VJ together. The moment I see VJ, that's when you're going to start seeing the trending pictures of me and her being together. And VJ, VJ will begin to feel on top of, oh my God, I mean, I feel so on top of the world. It's an amazing feeling. I'm like, yeah, sweetie. It's an amazing feeling. Me and VJ are going to feel so on top of the world. It's like an adrenaline rush. It's like a drug, man. It's like a drug. It's like a drug through your body. It's like an adrenaline rush. It's like a drug. A crazy, crazy drug. An adrenaline rush drug in your body. You know what I'm saying? It looks like crazy. So it's in here. And yeah, man. And when me and VJ go to the club, everyone around Los Angeles is staring. They pull out their phones. Hundreds of people take off their phones and take pictures. Because we're famous celebrities now. Take pictures and videos. Trying on some of those pictures, trying online. Whole world watching. Obviously, and when me and Vijay go into the club, everyone's staring at us because we're the perfect couple, obviously. And all these couples will feel like shit who are in the club. Oh my God, look at I and the perfect couple together. You're gonna see me dancing. You're gonna see Vijay dancing. Uh, you guys are gonna be excited to see me work because you don't know what it's like to see I famous, obviously. And I'm white. I don't hate me, Vijay. Whereas Vijay, you guys already know what it's like to see her famous because you've seen her in Hollywood. But you're gonna want to see Vijay. I wonder what it's like seeing Vijay now with Ivan, famous billionaire. Yeah, as Vijay is the main show too, obviously. As you constantly tune into her social media every day. You watch her videos, but you, you watch my videos more because I'm more interesting, obviously. Don't hate me, VJ. But you you guys obviously watch VJ's it, videos a lot. You go back and we watch VJ's videos too, obviously. See what I'm saying, girl? I wonder what it's like seeing Ivan, VJ, Ivan Famous out with his wife, VJ, you know what I'm saying? You see me dancing, you see VJ dancing, you see VJ dancing, you know what I'm saying? You see me dancing, you know what I'm saying? I'm like this. You know what I'm saying? You see me dancing. Oh my god, look at Ivan VJ dancing at the club. Yeah, man. Listen to music, you know what I'm saying? And guarantee when we dance, I don't know. I, I, I go, hey Vijay, let's go, let's go get around. Let's let's let's, let's go get around. I buy around. We me and Vijay have a couple shots. I don't want to get drunk, but I'll get. I want to get a nice tipsy buzz. I get, I take a good like four or five shots of vodka, rum, Captain Morgan. Me and Vijay, me and Vijay are pretty drunk. 
we're dancing. As soon as we start dancing, we start making out hardcore at the club, man. We start making out hardcore at the club. And when you see me and her out intimate and sexy are together, you know, so when I look at I and me, they're so intimate together, the perfect couple. You see me and VJ making out hardcore at the club, man. Hardcore make out. You look at something crazy, man. Like just crazy, 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 um, crazy make out sessions. Just, you look at something hot. Hot and passionate. So when you see me and VJ making out, it'll look passionate, obviously. Oh my god, it's very passionate. Oh, they love for each other, obviously. But it's also very sexy. Sexy and hot. When Ivan and VJ make out together. It's so hot, obviously. And the moment the moment you see those, you start seeing those trends, obviously, when me and VJ are in Los, in Los Angeles, when we see us at the airport, when we hang, when we go to get lunch, go eat dinner at the restaurant, we go to the club, and you see those pictures of Vito's trending, fans asking me for pictures from my Zane Spoke sales, you're looking at crazy what about my Zane Spoke sales. You guys are going to go back and look at my, you, you guys are going to go back and look at my final announce like a year ago. You're going to be like, fuck, man, yeah, Ivan already forgot about his Saturday Night Channel label. He's a billionaire now with his wife. Look at him, he's a billionaire now, billionaire now with, his, with his wife. He's living a life with his wife. He's trending every day wherever he goes. Videos and pictures of Ivan and Vijay trending every day. You know what I'm saying? He's looking, smoking out with a glowing beauty, obviously. And now he's, he's living the better life. Ivan totally forgot about Saturday Night Channel. Yes. And that's why I call this series Ivan's Miscellaneous Series. As once I am with my wife, and I'm now in a relationship with a girl like that, I am t and I'm a billionaire with her, and I'm living a life with her, I am totally going to forget about this stupid side of this channel. As now I'm in a relationship with my wife, to be in a relationship with a girl like that, a woman like that, I'm in a relationship with a hot-ass woman like that, me and her are having a good time, I'm in a relationship with her, we're both have together, me and Vijay are obviously what we're totally going to forget about our old life, man. Vijay will totally forget about her old life in Hollywood, I'm gonna ask you, hey, did you miss Hollywood? No, I, I, are you kidding me, man? I'm queen with you now. I'm free. I, I, VJ will miss Hollywood a little bit, obviously, but I told you the Hollywood system is fucked up. And VJ is totally gonna forget about her old, her old Hollywood life, too, obviously. I'm gonna forget about my old life. VJ will totally forget about her old, her old Hollywood life, obviously. Even, even VJ's friends, all of VJ's friends are like, oh my god, does VJ even remember me? Does VJ even remember me now? Because VJ is now famous with Ivan. All my so-called friends at Darcy, all the people who knew, my wife, knew me in my life, they're like, oh my God, does Ivan even remember me now? Now that he's a famous billionaire with his wife. Yeah. that's all. Me and VJ will be so famous, it'll feel like as if, oh my God, Ivan totally forgot about us. He doesn't even remember us. Because now me and her are so famous. Yeah. We'll see. All right, so we stay in Los Angeles for two days. Obviously. And then we fly to Vancouver. I mean, hey, let's get out of America. I, fly, I book a, a private flight. We fly private to Vancouver. And then what? And then we and we book that suite in the hotel for two months. A nice top month suite we'll stay in, obviously. And then me and Vija will register for our Scotiabank debit card and visa. And the moment I register for that Scotiabank debit card and visa, Vija will be like, oh my God, Ivan, look at all this money we have. Hey, Ivan, let's go on a clothes shopping spree. Let's buy all these clothes. Let's buy all these shoes. Let's buy all these shades. Let's buy all these purses. You know what I'm saying? Let's buy all this stuff. Like, yeah, sure, we let's go to the store. Let's buy all this stuff. I'm saying we're going on a huge clothes shopping spree. I don't know. On the first day, and not one day, we spend like I don't know seven grand on clothes. <laughs> <Yeah>. <coughs> a huge clothes shopping spree. You know what I'm saying? Mental reason, sweetie, do not go overboard like the celebrities. Get a good like forty pair of pants, forty pair of shirts, fifteen pair of shoes. I don't know, eight pairs of purses, but don't go overboard. You know what I'm saying? Get a good ten pair of shades, but don't go overboard and buy like a hundred shades. You're just wasting money. So me and Vijay will get a shitload of clothes, but let's not go overboard like he's celebrities. Celebrities waste so much money, obviously. Hey, Ivan, let's buy our yacht. You want to buy your... Ivan, you mentioned your video. You want to buy your... Ivan, let's buy our dream yacht. Let's do those sleepovers. I'm saying, Ivan, let's buy our jet. We don't have to fly commercial anymore. Hey, Vijay, let's, let's go. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and me and Vijay, we go, we go what? We go buy our jet. We go we buy a nice $70 million top-notch jet. Me and Vijay never had to fly commercial again. You're welcome, sweetie. Me and Vijay will be flying privately when we, when we travel to those countries. You know, so we buy our nice yacht. Me and Vijay do sleepovers in the yacht during those two months. I want to do sleepovers with Vijay in the yacht. We drive out in the ocean. We do sleepovers together. We listen to music. We have a, mar we have a margarita. And we do we say cheers. Cheers to the bright future ahead. Obviously. Obviously, right? He looks at me crazy. You know, say, hey Ivan, let's just 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 build that dream condo. Uh, okay, Vijay, let's build that condo. I hire a real estate agent. Okay, okay. This has never been done before, but I want I want to build a condo on top of the roof. Can you find me a building where I can build a condo on top of the roof? Tell the owner of the building I'm willing to pay them a nice five, six million dollars, a five, six million dollar fee to allow me to build the roof that condo on top of the roof. 
See what I'm saying? It's, and as long as you pay the owner of the building a nice five, six million dollars, they'll gladly let you build a car on top of the roof. You have to pay them a nice fee because there'll, there'll be renovations going on within the building. And so if you want, if you want to allow, if you want for them to allow you to build a car on top of the building, on top of the roof, you have to pay them a nice like six million dollars. Pay, I, I'm willing to pay them a nice five, six million dollars, which is a nice check for allowing you to build a car on top of the roof, which is nice, obviously. Right. Now, once that's all taken care of, we will call George Lucas, and we will have him come. Who has to pay for his own flights? I'm not paying for his flights because you're a billionaire. You're paying for your own flights. I'll pay for his hotel, and I'll pay for his uh his his his, his I'll send him a thirty thousand dollar e transfer. That pretty much takes care of his food. His food, obviously, because it only cost George Lucas a good, I don't know two thousand dollars, twenty hundred dollars for the two months for food around there. So thirty thousand dollars easily takes care of his food, obviously. And I'll pay for his hotel stay. Well, I'm not paying for his flight. You look at you 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 can easily afford a eight eight hundred dollar thousand dollar flight. You can easily afford that. You have to pay for your own flight, but I'll, I'll pay for your hotel and I'll pay for your feeding. Because you're a billionaire, you're paying for your own flight. I'm not paying for your flight. Understand? And George Drews will be helping me and my wife plan Sky Source. Hey Ivan, you're gonna need to create a business account. Me and VJ create our business account. We transfer nine something dollars towards our business. Account. Hey George, we're not taking a loan. We're gonna fund the movie ourselves. We take nine seven million dollars and we transfer that to our business account. Obviously, that's used for funding what the luxury hotel party, the red carpet, the flights. You know what I'm saying? The limo driver, the hotel stays, paying the crew and all the actors, the special effects, the, sp the set building, the costumes, the weapons, the extras, all going towards it. Right, two thousand dollar gift card. Um, the, the photography stu studio equipment. For, 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 the, for the actors, all that stuff. It's all going towards it, man. Sponsoring the actors with clothing, their training wear, their tackle, their, their, their wear, their training wear, tackle, horse, and training wear. You know what I'm saying? All that stuff. It's all going towards the budget, obviously. The IMS cameras, the equipment for the, the, equipment for the cameras, all the budget's going towards that. Hence why you have a big budget, that way you get a kick ass movie, man. Obviously. Okay, Ivan, you, 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 you're, you're going to need an office. Yeah, George, I don't want to lease an office space in Vancouver. I prefer to build my own office. That way you have it. That way it's built the way you and your wife want it. Because if you lease office space, they won't, there's a good chance the owner won't let you renovate the office. Because it's not your office, obviously. Whereas if you what? If you if if you what? If you build it from scratch and you hire architects, you get to build it the way you want it. It's yours. It's your office, obviously. It's yours. Sim Sanger. Sim Sanger. So me and Vijay are gonna have to me and K Ivan, you're gonna have to find land. Me and me and Vijay, well, I'll hire a real estate agent. I'll have him or her find me land. Hey, can you find me land in Vancouver? A good acre, acre and a half of land's enough. Acre a good acre of land's enough. I want to build my own my own sky source office and building for the special effects team. Yeah, Ivan, I can find you land. And me and me and my wife and George will go land shopping. Let's see. You know what I'm saying? Hey Ivan, you're gonna need to trademark your name. Me and VJ are gonna have to hire a lawyer to trademark our Sky Source Entertainment brand name. You know how when you watch movies you have the copyright? Well, if you want a copyright for all for all my movies, you're gonna have the copyright before the movie starts, obviously. The copyright, the copyright uh warning, whatever it is. For you to for you to copyright your company, you need to you need to trademark your name. And that's why me and VJ are gonna have to hire lawyers to trademark our name, obviously. George Rich will say, hey guys, hey Ivan, what's the name of your company? Sky Source Entertainment, sick name, huh? Okay, Ivan, you're gonna need to copyright this name, that way no one steals your name. And then what? We, we hire lawyers. And they copyright our we copyright our name, obviously. And once you see pictures of me and George Lucas training online, you guys are all like, holy shit, Ivan really is starting Sky Source. Yes, a lot of the stuff that I'm telling you right now will be coming to life in real life. I don't know, you see pictures of me and Vijay training in Vancouver. Oh my god, Ivan really is when we're living in Vancouver. You see the process of the condo game built. People take pictures of the condo. You see me training with George Lucas. Yeah, you, a lot of the stuff that I'm saying is coming to life, obviously. See, right? Yeah, Ivan, you're gonna need to you're gonna need to find land. I hire a real estate agent to find me land. The best thing to do is to hire if you want to find land, you have to find hire a real estate agent. They will gladly find you land, they'll easily find you land, obviously. I don't know, me and Visa we buy the land. Oh, oh cost for an acre of land will probably cost, I don't know, it won't cost that much. Probably a good sixty, seventy thousand dollars for an acre of land. It's not that not that expensive. Fifty thousand dollars for 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 an acre. Acre of land will probably cost like forty thousand dollars, not that expensive. Me and VJ pay forty thousand dollars. We buy the land, obviously, and we what? And then once we buy the land, me and VJ are gonna have to hire an architect company. So just like we hire the architect company who built my condo, I'll hire that same architect company to build my to, to plan my office, to design my office. 
me and Reason, we hired an architect company, the best architect company you can call Vancouver, hired the best architect company, and me and Vijay, me and Vijay we start discussing our, our interior layout of our office. So me, my wife, the seven team, the out, me, me and my wife, the seven team, where we work all that stuff. Okay, we want a parking lot. So the construction teams, the, the, the architects designed the parking lot, obviously. We want to have some trees. You want the sky source sign. You know what I'm saying? When we enter, when we enter the building, you get the GPS. Welcome to sky source. You have the nice foyer. The deck, the secretaries have their open desk. You have the sky source sign. You know what I'm saying? And, and we have couches where the actors sit. Actors and crewmen sit, obviously. We have a room where me, me and wife have our own office. The other five share their own office, and we have our boardroom. And that's it. Obviously, see what I'm saying here? A nice, a nice. You're looking at a top. Now, I showed you guys pictures of what I'm talking about. You're looking at a top notch luxury office. Me and Vijay are going to own, man. And that's my wife is so proud of me. It's because of me. She has to live this amazing life with her husband. Me and Vijay are living the life in our personal roles, like living life in our business life. We own this big ass guy since our entertainment company, bigger than all these hollow companies. You know what I'm saying? And, and, and we're living the life. We have this nice ass office. Yeah, man. A nice parking lot. A nice parking lot. I might, I'm going to put money into like a nice like parking lot, too. A nice parking lot. I might even have like a waterfall. A nice waterfall. I might have a waterfall. A, a nice waterfall in my um, in my office. A waterfall fountain. Oh my god. I, I read his office is top notch. Yeah, man. Look at the top. And as soon as they, they enter, welcome to Sky Source. It's like top notch. A luxury office, man. I'll put a good, I don't know, 5.5, .5, 6 million towards the office is enough. Obviously. So even though it's a small office, it's top notch quality. See what I'm saying here? It's top luxury quality. It's luxury quality. Top notch quality. So I'm saying here. So B and are gonna have to hire architects to plan out our office design. Vijay already knows what I'm talking about. Vijay can see Vijay. Vijay already knows the kind of office me and you are gonna own. We're gonna own this top notch office. I'm gonna put money towards. Okay, Ivan, you're gonna need to put money towards your payment. Once, once we build, once one, right? I, okay, okay, I, okay. I also want, I also want this the building for the special effects team built right beside our office, obviously. And, we, and we're going to have to hire architects to plan out the layout for that building, too, with a special flexing where the world. Okay, we have the console art room, where we do the console arts. You have the room for the sound sound, sound department, obviously. The special flexing department, all that stuff. You have all these different rooms, different departments, where all the special effects people are going to work, obviously. And George Lucas will tell me all, the, Ivan, this is how many departments we are. And then me and Vijay are going to have to hire architects to, to design the layout for that building for the special effects team, too, obviously. And once that's taken care of, we hire a construction company, and they're going to begin building our office based on the on the on, on the arc, on, on the what on the architectural design, obviously. Now you have those architectural design, and the architects design it. We and Vijay have to do that for our condo as well as our what our skyscraper's office as well as the building for a special. We're going to have to hire an architect coming for that, obviously. And I'm also going to put money towards an advance. I'm going to hire engineers. Right, I'm going to hire engineers to design a super advanced payment system for to pay the actors and crewmen. And the extras. So the extras, I'm gonna have. I'm gonna tell the guy, hey, I want, I want a system for the extras where they have this card. They sign up online. They have this card. And when they scan this, when they scan the machine or some of that, they get their money in the bank. That way, it's easier for everyone. You have this card. You have this card. And they just scan it and they get their money in the bank. It's easier that way. As I'm not a fan of paying people check or cash, as the money can easily get stolen. See what I'm saying here? And I'm also right. And you're looking at a super vast payment system whereby. You type in the actor's salary on a certain day, the money goes straight into his account. You have received two hundred thousand dollars for the term of the movie. I'm gonna tell, hey, I want a GPS system in this payment system. They designed some super advanced payment system. Six hundred thousand dollars is high, high, high tech. As most companies have a good like ten, fifteen thousand dollar payment system, and I'm putting six hundred thousand dollars. That's very, very high tech for a payment system. You're looking at something very, very. And that's why these actors are all like, holy shit, Sky is top notch quality. Yeah. I'm also going to put like a million dollars towards this computer software equipment for me and my wife is 17. I'm going to have a top-notch computer where I write my scripts. Everything's easy for me. You know what I'm saying? Everything's easy for me and my wife when we make our business calls. Me and my wife will have the head, we'll have the, the headphones, obviously. We just speak best company for cameras and all the best companies around the world pop up. Call the company, we order the cameras. Everything's easy for us. So that's why seven people is more than enough. Is you put money towards an advanced payment system. For the secretaries, they have all these callbacks. The system shows all the callbacks. They just call people back. They have their headphones. Everything is simple. Seven people is more than enough. As the secretaries are going to get a shitload of calls from the agents. And they're also going to be making a shitload of business calls. I don't pay one million for nothing, obviously. As they're my co- They're, they're my co-producers, obviously. Right? And once that's all taken care of, me and Vijay can now take our one-year vacation. We'll send George Lucas home. 
George Drew was really like, all right, man, can I stay with you guys now? I'm like, no, man, no, George. You were helpful for the two months. We don't need you anymore. Go home and spend time with your wife and your family and your kids. Have a good time, and I'll see you in a year's time. You'll be consulting for Last of Us and Sons. And me and Vijay can now take our own vacation. And the moment that the construction team starts building the office and building the rooftop condo, and this, this, the building for the special testing, guaranteed some people might even take videos. Hey, I'm building a building right now. They might do that. And people who pass by the office... They're going to take pictures. Hey, I and VJ are building this office here. And that might be trending online. Hey, I and VJ own this rooftop condo right here. They're building their rooftop condo right here. They might take pictures and videos. That might be trending online. Yeah, man, that's how crazy it's going to be. You know what I'm saying? And me and VJ can now take our one-year vacation. I'm touching my calendar for a second.